Hello everyone, welcome to the Tarts of Natural Healing in Christ, a healing place. Our church offers prayer service as well as regular church service and this today is our prayer service. We would like to all offer prayer to bring peace and serenity to the hearts of those with unrest. There is much sadness and the world has a bit of a feeling of unease lately. Recently, there have been many deaths that were unnecessary of young African American boys. We would like to take a moment today to pray for those boys and their families and to help bring some peace and ease to others, others in the African American community as well as in other communities. What is occurring now is not just a black problem, but it is a world problem that should be addressed. Though change cannot come in a day, Little things like this can make a huge difference. So we ask that our Lord hears this prayer. Job nineteen twenty five. For I know that my Redeemer lives, and at the last he will stand upon the earth. And after my skin has been thus destroyed, yet in my flesh I shall see God. Please, Lord, bring peace to those hearts that are ill not at rest, into their hearts, hearts of all the families who lost loved ones, hearts of those who knew those who died, hearts of those who feel pain and sympathy for what is happening now in the world. Come into their hearts and give them peace, give them answers, let them find you and help them to have better, happier lives. Help them heal and recover, bring warmth and serenity. Death is so painful for everyone, for friends, family, and even acquaintances. We offer this moment of prayer for these black boys that died. These black boys were teenagers and they died after the Michael Brown incident. There have been many more, I'm sure, that others are unaware of or that when they died it was not brought to the attention of the media and the rest of the world. So their deaths were literally just known among the family and friends who knew them. We offer a prayer for them and their families. Please offer a moment of silence for Tamir Rice. Tamir Rice was only 12 years old when he was shot by an officer. Please take a moment of silence for Cameron Tillman. He died at 14. Please offer a moment of prayer for Vaughn Derek Myers Jr. He died at an older age, but he was still a teenager. He died at 18 years old. Please offer a moment of silence for Laquan McDonald. He died at only 17. Please offer a moment of silence for Jeffrey Holden. He died at 18 years old. Please offer a moment of silence for Kushan Whiten. He died at 18 years of age. Please offer a moment of silence for Miguel Benton. He died at 19. Please offer a moment of silence for Levy Weaver. Please offer a moment of silence for Sergio Ramos. He was killed at 18 years of age. Please offer a moment of silence for Rashad McIntosh. He was only 19 when he died at the hands of a police officer. For all of these young children who never had the chance to grow up and to have families of their own and to go to college or find love, for all that they have lost, we pray that the Lord will bring them peace and let them rest instead of worry and feel that their time was too short. Death is usually so quick, but it lasts forever for the families and those left behind. Please, Lord, your healing energy into the families that have lost their children, these these poor African American children. healing for we know you can heal anything nothing is impossible for you 
that will conclude this prayer service everyone thank you for being here today and for listening and we thank you so much for your prayers the more prayers that people give the more powerful that it is it is people coming together in the lord's name to call upon him to heal and do the impossible We thank you all today and we wish you all the best. God bless. Isaiah 41.10 Isaiah 41.13 Fear not, for I am with you. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you. I will help you. I will uphold you with my righteous right hand. For I, the Lord your God, hold your right hand. It is I who say to you, fear not, I am the one who helps you.